สวัสดีครับผมจูมายาลิครับวันนี้เราอยู่ที่กรุงเทพมหานครครับแล้วแล้วเราจะไปประเทศเวียดนามครับกรุงดิ้งนี้เป็นกรุงดิ้งหมายที่โทเลส A340 A340 ของโทเลสโอเค so <laughs> that's all I can say for that thank you right now in Thai I'm trying ผมพูดภาษาไทยได้นิดหน่อยโอเค so นิดหน่อยครับ so there we go um, uh, we're in Thailand like I just said and we're gonna take this freshly updated A340 600 from Tolis to Vietnam so we're gonna go ahead and get everything's ready so we're um I think we should be aligned and ready to go now everything's great this has been updated quite a bit I just did a fresh zip install and the frame rate has shot through the roof which of course makes me happy probably for lower end computers and everything so uh, let me check and see the options here did they um change something I'll be right back. All right. After that, um, hiccup. We're getting ready to go, so we have to um, hurry up before the um, sun goes down because we're here. So everything is actually going well. So um, go ahead and send these away while we close our doors. Go ahead and get our doors closed. Close all these. Alrighty, good stuff. So, get the fuel pumps turned on while the doors are closing. What was that? Main pump three fault. Yeah, cause it's not on yet. Now it is. Okay. Arm these. Got our APU bleed. Turn that on. Sorry, passengers. We were keeping a little bit warm and toasty back there so dim turn that off even the lights on because we need them in a bit so beacon light come on let's get ready to get out of here awesome Flight plan here. Performance is there. Let's call the tug. Let's do it. Captain, your toe's coming. Oh yeah, we got windmilling now. That's awesome. That must be new. That seems to be new in this update. It up. All right. Looks like the doors and hatches are closed, and we're ready to connect. Please connect. 
Let's get out of here. Welcome aboard, Captain. Toast connected, bypass pens inserted. Go and kill the parking brake when you're ready to go. I will do just that. Parking brake is unlocked or released. Here comes the pushback. Oh, Light them up. Okay, it's not. They fixed the seat position, I guess. I was just looking at it wrong. Okay. Hey, what are you doing? So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, dual start the plane here, just like I did last time. Or oh, whoops, we didn't see that. That video got truncated because my re the airplane crashed the desktop. So. That wasn't really seen. Whoops. Mission start. Now let's dual start. While that's doing it, we're going to... Go ahead and get that done. I love how it's coming up a lot smoother now. Ignition. I want flight controls. Can I use that yet? Yeah, we need to go up 4.3 on the trim. That's a heck of a lot of up trim. Oh, we can do it. And we will go ahead and start the other two engines when the pushback is stopped. Okay, here we go. This back to auto. Just about done here. Go ahead and set your parking brake. Okay, parking brake is set. And we're disconnecting the tow. Give me just a moment. We start those other two up. The two engines started up. Disconnecting hand signals. Disconnected. Signal and pin on the right. Take it easy and have a safe flight. All right. Awesome. Set up and ready to go. So we're gonna set this back to normal. RTO. Flight control test. Great stuff. So. Signal and pin, good stuff. Turn this nose gear to taxi. Everything else there is good, so uh, let's turn on the taxi cam. It works now over here on the uh, captain side. Yeah, good stuff. Alrighty, catch you guys. Oh, sorry, 
Back to two. Catch you guys on the runway. Okay, we're here on the runway, so let's get ready to go. So we, this taxi cam is not going to come in handy anymore, so I'll go ahead and turn that off. They can turn in the center, but I do need my um, displays up. So spoilers are auto brake is already set to RTO. Multi scan set to auto. GCS set to auto. Okay, system number one. Auto. T A R A. All. Turn these off. And turn this off. The integrated lights up. That's all we need. Check the cabin. Strobe lights on. Right turn off the camera on. Nose to take off. Landing lights on. APU should in fact be shutting down. We'll just have to wait for it to see what happens. So this is all good. Let's um Oh, that was a bug that was reported on explain. The forum is those textures are transparent. I thought that was just the background lights. Okay. That's interesting. Take off config. Let's do. I can break off. Let's get out of here. Okay. Get it onto the runway. I forgot to set my backup altimeter. Oh well. Okay. Take one. Have a wing strike. Very positive rate. You're up. Goodbye, Groom Tap. Hello, Da Nang. Well, we have to get there. To Tase Diden. Diden. I think that's how he said. Oh, got low clouds today, have we? So I'm just gonna go ahead and go autopilot, I suppose. And I'll catch you on cruise. Do you guys stand by? No. I don't want to do it. Now we're good. Anyhow, see you guys at cruise. Okay, here we are over the sunset. Nice sunset flight. Yo, the lighting issue there. Interesting. Oh, we've got some lighting issue over here on the wing spars. I'm not sure what that is, but maybe it's probably an artifact of my computer being a low end computer. But um, we're up here, so that's good. And um, over here on the. We've got already a night vision on the seats here. The screens. Turn these on and off. Yeah, I can see a little bit down there. Passing through. The sun's already setting. And that's just an artifact of the fact that the time zone I live in. That'll be changing soon. So, it helps. So, um, well, I guess I'll put a small segment here. I mean, not as big and bad as the last one. You know, I did have to. I was a long haul, but I had to be really good on that segment. This is a much, much shorter flight, so we've got a lot less time. 
and I do have to get back in the cockpit because the top is coming up. So anyways, we're here at 39,000 feet today. You're nice and possibly high. So I'm going to go ahead and switch the NAS only. Anyways, um, I will see you guys on set and have a good flight. Alright, hello, we are back. So, um, chúng ta đã đi đến Việt Nam. Chúng ta ở thành phố Đà Nẵng. Đà Nẵng là thành phố không. Mình không biết. <laughs> okay, I'm trying. <laughs> so, I just have to keep trying after a minute without speaking Vietnamese properly. Anyhow, I can write beat news that much with things not to think anyways um so we're already here so I'm gonna go ahead and start getting us to descend by um descend to 2000 feet here popping the switch out let's open this and we do not want that that'll send us way down here is manage descent that's good that's what we want so seatbelt signs back on good stuff this is like 200 feet temperature down in Tanang is 27 degrees nice and warm here in Vietnam so uh, magnetic heading in the wind so 070 at 04 knots 070 04 knots we're good so since this runway is let's see we'll help with the runway runway then. 11,000 feet 10,000 feet that seems okay. Not as short as I thought it was, but just to be on the safe side, we're going to go out of brakes too. So that's that. We're on our way down. So I will catch you guys. Oh, we're under our descent profile, but I'm okay with that. Catch you guys on final. Okay, we are here. Ride slope is alive. Localizer is captured. Let's land the aircraft and then call this a day. So autopilot off. My airplane. Autopilot was acting a little bit weird today. I'm not sure what was going on, but I didn't want to. Oh, drop the warning there. It did not want to um, capture the proper speed. Ooh, I forgot to turn the no smoking sign back to on. That was on auto, but the gear is down now, so we're good. So let's go ahead and start easing in. This runway, I'm not sure exactly how long it is, so I'm going to be extra careful on the... Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, no. Camera got really weird. That was not cool. night so I want to use, make full use of my ILS. We're on 35 left I believe. It's to the left obviously. Why doesn't it seem to have... I know there's two runways here. Why doesn't it seem to have... Um, runway lighting like the one on the right does. Do we really need to sidestep? I can sidestep. And now it's starting to come up. Okay. Level off. The frame rate is running excellent, by the way. This is much better than the last time I tried to record. When we got in, eventually got a um, crashed desktop. Not, not the plane crash, the uh, simulator itself crashed. That is a One runway, right? My OS is guiding us in like it is. It's starting to worry me. I know there's a 35 left here. I've used it before. Is that the shorter runway? We got all our brakes too, so it's okay. Let's level off the descent. This long airplane on a short runway isn't exactly appealing, you know. Okay, now I'm starting to see a little bit more. It's probably not actually ILS equipped, at least not an X plane. But it is definitely there. I love how smooth this is running. 500. Yeah, it's definitely there. Okay, let's... 400. Interesting how it's not lit the same way as the runway on the right, though. It's definitely there, though. 300. 100 above. Continue. Oh, no. Hi. 
200. Minimum. Yeah, there it is. 100. Sink rate. 50. Sink rate. 40. Sink. 30. 20. Retard. Retard. 10. 5. Okay. Let us stop the airplane. Like, really stop. Okay. 60 knots. Oh, we're good. Both the reversers. And disarm the auto brakes. Welcome to Ta Nang. In Vietnam. Đây là Việt Nam. Ta đã đi đến Việt Nam. À, ok. Slowly edging off the uh, is that a taxiway off. Whoops, I missed that. This sliding on this runway is not good. But I just speed it up until we get off the runway. Now that we're off the runway, we can watch the replay. I can see how that landing went, so I'm not exactly confident that that looks nice, but let's just take a look and see how it went. Yeah, that was more beautiful than I thought it was. Just got to worry, uh, still worrying about center lining the plane, because I'm not good at that. It's a uh, different plane style that I gotta learn to fly well, and, oh, well, we just have to keep challenging ourselves, won't we? So I'll turn up the pedestal lights, and, uh, let's see. So as not to burn anything on the ground, let's bring the flaps all the way in. She has to stand by. Stand by here. This is gonna go off. All stays there. The WXR and the all the other radars here. Predictive wind shear goes to off. Radar system off. Multi-scan, manual, GCS to off. We're good. So let's turn the APU on because we're going to need that once we stop the plane. Have power. Yep. The SOM. Nope. Counting in Cantonese because I can. Turn this to off. Yeah, that's why I put it on auto. Sometimes you forget to turn on the strobes. Oh, it was already on auto. I guess I'm being silly. What a day. Alright, this is the taxi. Beacon. Nav and logo stay on for now. That's gonna come on and stay there. So what else? Landing system's off. So we're already on the ground. Safely. And break the windshield off. Oh yes, we need the taxi cam. Put the tax Captain's taxi cam on. There we go. Oh, that's uh, awesome. I can see things. Anyways, catch you guys at the gate. Okay, totally forgot to narrate that, but we're here parked. Taxi cam is not showing... Oh, it's showing a little something. Well, not enough little somethings, but we're here. So let me go ahead and turn off that light in the front. So don't blind anybody. Parking brake is in fact set. Get the APU bleed on. And shut down the engines. Ooh, forgot to turn on the panel lights too. Shut down the engines. Let's go back on APU power. Outer two engines shut down. Welcome to Da Nang. Xin chào Vietnam. Seatbelt sign to off. No smoking sign to that. Emergency exit lights on. And we're here. Oh yes, fuel tanks must be turned off. For safety reasons, we can't refuel a plane with the... I said fuel tanks, I meant fuel pumps, because I can't speak English anymore. Um, fuel pumps must be turned off. For safety reasons. Don't want to refuel a plane with um, 
Oh, those are cross feeds. The fuel pumps still on. That would cause very bad accidents. As in moving fuel while they're putting fuel in. This is not a military aircraft, so let's not feed it like one. Flight directors will go off. And we're in. Nice and safe. Now I'll turn off the captain's taxi camera. Unlock the door. Open the door. Okay, and let's see if the um, jetway is working. Beacon light to off. It is! Awesome! It works! It's coming to touch us, although being literally right out there. That was a fun flight. I really do wish I could get some flights in on this thing at uh, daytime. It seems to like different time zones to the point where I always have one half of the flight at day, one half at night. I guess being the night half. So let's open some doors so we can actually get some light. So ground handling. Bring up everything except the fuel trunk because we're not the fuel truck because we're not going anywhere else tonight. Especially not me, because I am in fact incredibly tired. So open this door, two right, open, four right, open, open the cargo doors. Okay. something taking off behind us. Have a nice flight, weather out there is fine. Alright, let's wait for that last catering truck to wheel itself up here. And we'll call this a day. I gotta get a screenshot shot somehow for this. I know what I'll do. Let's take it from the original video. There's a way to do it. Not now though, I am super tired. Wait. I, I know what I'll do. I know when I'll do it. Everything's in place. Alright, that is our video for today. Our flight, A34600. We'll go back to um, Flight Simulator 2020 hopefully next time, because I have to update. It's still in the process of making this video, because you know Flight Simulator 2020 has updates that are endless and they never run out. They're mandatory. They are now, you just have to look for it. They're mandatory, you can't fly until you update. Whatever, it is what it is. Anyways, thank you for watching the video. I'll see you guys next time, and goodbye. Come on, Zutnio.